back to the channel, Natalie here. Um, today's date is January the 18th, 2021. I'm like, we're already over halfway through January, and it's like, wow. Um, it's amazing. So, uh, let's just get into the video. Um, so today's video is the January 2020 scent box unboxing. Um, I went ahead and took it out of the envelope and everything. For starters, um, this is not the little keepsake box that we got in December. Um, one second. Yeah, sorry about that. So, um, this is the little keepsake box that we got in December. With the two fragrances. So, I was... From what I read, and I might have misunderstood it, I thought we would get one of those every month, but now this came in this, so I guess we're gonna start getting these, but I guess I can keep my perfume in here, but anyway. Let's just get on to it. Um, so I do the, this is my second month getting scent box, so I do the two um, perfume samples a month uh, option. I pay 24. $24 and change but the lowest subscription is $14 $14.95 yeah and that's just one perfume sample a month um but the reason I did two was because I could unlock more um perfumes to choose from which when I went through um to fill up my calendars I didn't notice that many new options but yeah so I know you guys didn't come here for that, so let's get into it. So here is our two atomizers. We have a gold and a pink, and we're gonna start off with the gold because gold is your girl's favorite color. Um, like actually, light blue is. So we got one of those last month, but my second favorite color is gold. Um, so each month I tried to do like different perfume samples. Um are two different perfumes from the same company. So last month it was Boot um Burberry. And this month is Ariana Grande. Um because my birthday is on the twenty fifth of this month. So yeah, I said we're gonna try Ariana Grande. So uh this is Ariana Grande and this is cloud and one of the good things about scent boxes since each month you get a new atomizer with your perfume sample they just put the name of the perfume at the bottom where at see let me show you you just twist it up like a lipstick see twist it up like a lipstick and pull it out and there is your sample this sample will last um 30 days I think it's at 120 sprays. So basically you just put it down and you twist it down to close it. Um, but Scent Bird will only send you a new atomizer every three to six months or something. So basically what they do is put the name of the perfume on the actual sample so you know what it is. But yeah, that's one. Re that's the main reason I went with Scent Box. It's because I wanted a new atomizer every month because these samples are glass. These containers are glass. So I'm like, I don't need that busting and getting perfume everywhere because I don't think you're going to be able to get perfume out of clothing and everything it spills on. So yeah, that's why I went with that. But um, this is Ariana Grande and this is Cloud. Uh, it's the fragrance family is floral, which I love floral fragrances. I'm um, sorry, I'm gonna try to read this, y'all. Um, okay, top notes: lavender, pear, and bergamot. Bergamot. Middle notes are coconut, um, praline, and vanilla orchard. And the bottom notes are cashmere. Um, that's really all I wrote was the notes. Um, this is a very floral scent. Actually, I sprayed this earlier today. And every so often, I can smell it on my shirt. It's different. Um, 
I don't want to spray it because you know it's very floral. I love it. It's different when I sprayed it. I was kind of like, hmm. It's a good different though. I like it. Um, not to mention the packaging on like the full size of this is absolutely gorgeous. Um, but yeah, I highly recommend that. So I tried that today. But the next one, check out this like pink, almost purple. Like it, it's like pink and purple, kind of like a dark pink uh, atomizer. But this is also Ariana Grande, and this is Airy. Uh, and the fragrance family for this one was Cyper. C-H-Y-P-R-E. I don't know what else that would be. I think it says Cyper. But this is Airy. Uh, top notes are crispy pear, pink grapefruit, pink, excuse me, pink grapefruit, juicy raspberry. Um, and the middle notes are soft mugus, muget, m-u-g-u-e-t. Rosebuds and Vanilla Orchard. But the base notes are marshmallow, what is it? Creamy musk, uh, and blonde woods. Creamy musk. I can't read my own handwriting. So yeah, same thing. Twist that up. Pull it out. Thirty sprays. I haven't actually sprayed this one yet. And then you twist it down. Same thing. Name is on the bottom. Um, let's see here. So you go. Oh, and that's the thing about perfumes. You'll smell it and it smells good, but then when you actually spray it on yourself, you it might not mix well with your body chemistry. So you know, before you break the bank. And spend fifty to a hundred dollars on a full size perfume. Get the little samples. And scent box is great. They give you free exchanges. So if you get one, two, or even three perfume samples a month, and you don't like it, well, you know what? You can send it back and get another one completely free. So, boom. Um, that one is actually stronger. Not gonna lie, I'm not much for strong perfumes. That one is a lot stronger though. Um, uh, my bad. I feel like that would last longer though. Like I said, uh, cloud lasts pretty long because I sprayed it on at 10 or 11. And every so often I can smell it. But I feel like that one would last much longer. Um, definitely... Definitely not an everyday scent for myself, but um, I only like to wear stronger scents on like, I don't want to say special occasions, but when I'm dressed up more, going out to eat somewhere fancier, you know, something like that. Um, I prefer more um, not so strong scents for a daily scent, for daily wear, but um. Hey, what did I want to try? And the packaging on it was so cute. And that's kind of the thing. Like, when I'm looking online, because I don't know what to do, I'll check out, like, a brand, and then I'll see which perfume packaging I like the best. And then I read the notes. And I can usually judge pretty well based off the description of the perfume, if it's something I think I like or not. Because so far, out of the four that I have, uh, there's not one that I hate. I like them all, so... Like I said, that's good. That's just... I get the musk. The musk is strong. But highly recommend Scentbox, y'all. Um, that perfume. That pretty great. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give it a big, giant thumbs up. Please comment down, down below with any comments, suggestions, questions, video ideas. Thank you guys for watching this video. Stay safe and have a great day. Love y'all. God bless and see you in the next one. Bye.